is going on everyone this is uh the next day i'm out here messing around with this panoramic trying to see what's all how to get it to work and open um these uh this is the second gen um mini cooper that he told me so this is the one that has the double tilt now i've done a previous one mini cooper sunroof and that one was the first generation and the wiring was pretty much simple for for that one it was more simpler than a g6 um from what i can remember now this one is giving me a tough time um it's it's not responding to anything and uh this is the only i was starting to think that the motor was bad or something so this is what i've got gotten so far um i've been broken down and opened up the motor um this is a relay um so i'm guessing that this sunroof requires a relay which is extremely weird man um so i've been able to bypass it so this is what the motor looks like with this covering off of it so this is what you're gonna have to do for this particular sunroof um this is what the switch looks like the switch is also different from the other um mini cooper sunroof all right so again this is once you have it open this is what you're going to do these two spots right here is a jump spot so i got my uh it doesn't matter which way uh right now uh whether if it's because it, it's gonna uh positive and negative so that's forward and reverse so if you can listen I don't know if you saw it. I'm trying to do it one-handed. Let me see if I can bear with you. Just bear with me. So you see the motor moving. All right, so I'm kind of crossing, which I shouldn't be doing. All right, so let me see if I can get a better way to show you guys this, um, this setup here first. All right, we got that one in there. And then what we're going to do is So look in there, see it spinning. All right, so this is how you jump the Mini Cooper. Um, I know for sure that no one is uh, just wiring this up. Um, this is not getting just wired up. It, it requires a lot more and obviously that's clear as day a relay. Um, so, and there isn't no, no way of uh, being able to tell. I've been playing with these wires uh and these are from the actual motor i'm probably guessing that this here is maybe the relay wire but within the harness you don't see it um like these wires are wires that i won't be using so um and that runs to the dome light over here and then you got wires that run over here, but these are to sun visors and stuff for the lights for that. So you're not going to be using that. Um, so, yeah, guys, if you want to um, be able to get power to the Mini Cooper a second gen sunroof, this is what you got to do in order to make it work. So I'm going to put all this back together. And um, what I'm going to do is try to see if I can get some wires. I might have to get break out my soldering, my solder gun, and solder two wires here. And uh, I'm not sure on reversing, but I'll figure something out as far as getting it to, um, you know, be able to open and close with the switch. Maybe I can, uh, you know, just do something homemade wise, and then you won't be needing this all this junk or basically all this wire it'd just be a two wire uh, plus whatever wire that I add on so yeah this is this video is for anyone who is seeking these style roofs but keep in mind that this panoramic is different than the other mini Cooper roof um, so keep that in mind the other mini Cooper roof I think there's a brown wire the 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 positive and hot simple and then there's just like a brown wire that you're hooking up literally for the switch and the switch is just a button so um this one is obviously more 
comes with it and it, it's you know so uh, I think this would be to open it to open it that would be there and uh, these would be light controls but um yeah I would say this is progress uh, so now I'm just gonna go ahead and get this back in here and then uh, see how we're, we're going so now what I'm doing is just looking at uh, how I would hook up my power and I, I see it so I, it really doesn't probably require me taking this off so let me see all right y'all so I got it back in there and here are those two wires so I just what I did was just hook them around just for testing right now until I um, I'll take this motor in and get it on the solder I'll show you guys that soldering those two wires together um, so in my mind right now this is bypassed there's no really controlling right now um, but it should still open so I'm I'm gonna reach over here and hook up these wires and then I'll get you guys back on but I'll get you on when I hook up the last wire all right y'all so a little cheated but um we had a little boo boo a hiccup whatever you want to call it um now let me break down let me break this down like I said uh, earlier this is a this is a um a relay okay and it just it's not working with this on here I'm telling you that now um, plugging all this back up is just it's it's not working so um, even with my way of wiring it back up it's not working so the way that I was able to get it to work as you can see this is what you're gonna to have to split so this is the, this is where I'm gonna to have to solder so I just got them crammed in there just to to make it work and uh, so what I'm gonna do is hang on sorry about that y'all so this is what I'm gonna do is uh, get these wires touching to show y'all that this way works and uh, you see the roof is open when I bought it it was closed and that's it on tilt it's on tilt right now hang on so now I want to close that tilt because the sunroof's Maybe, okay, I'll figure that out. But hang on, guys. Let me uh, get this other way going, too. All right, so it's on tilt right now. I'm going to get these wires to touch. Hang on. It keeps slipping off. And... That's it all the way back. You take it off once you get it uh, all the way back. So I'm gonna close it one more time for you guys. All right. And that's it. So I gotta figure out closed part, tilt part. Figure that issue out then. Uh, yeah, we're in the money, but yeah, it sucks because this literally is worthless and useless. I'm telling you that this is useless. This whole once you open it up and you get to seeing all those like you, the G6 is so simple and the first generation is so simple. It, it don't even the first generation doesn't even have this on it doesn't have this on it this is some extra and there's also something okay so like this is giving it power the motor power okay so I had tapped in here the first time and I just wired uh, you know twist my wire on here my, my hot my ground okay I went to put you know as you guys saw it all in there and stuff like that um, I started having trouble with it. it it wasn't doing nothing and you know it was just it was weird but you saw it on the ground the motor is moving and stuff like that so I had to take it out again and then put those wires there 
and then then I had um, response from the sunroof. So this is whole this this whole stuff here is just is is useless. You don't even need it. I, I probably won't even need this to be honest with you. Uh, I'm just being honest. Uh, I'll just have to try to see how I would tap into um, uh, the the tilt mode. I would have to tap into that. But um. Alright guys, if you enjoyed this video, if you like this video, uh, subscribe, give it a thumbs up, share, do whatever you guys want to do. I'm going to have more, um, I'm going to have more fire video for you guys, more how-tos, um, more breakdown videos for you guys. Um, so just stay tuned, stay subscribed, um, and I'll see you guys soon. The, I, w I like to add in. Um, plans so excuse me if I might end the video or you might think I'm ending the video um, but today is just uh, going over wire um, with this because I talked to the guy I bought this off of he told me that this was different and he didn't understand how or, or why um, that this was different so that that was one more thing that put a halt in my testing because I knew it would have just been all day thing and then I didn't want didn't I wouldn't have wanted to buy it. So um it's good that I got this working. Uh, I at least, you know, familiar with opening it and closing in it. Um so it didn't take too much of me scratching my head. Um so I'll see you guys soon. Enjoy this video. Well I hope you enjoyed this video and see you guys later.